This is the world's biggest sand battery and it heats an entire town in Finland in order to basically prevent that town from needing to use fossil fuels. So, a sand battery, I mean, kind of new, kind of strange, kind of different, but it actually works incredibly well. Australian scientists have built a quantum battery with instantaneous charge, a 1000 fold gain in energy storage. Is this real? Well, this is Australian scientists that are saying they've done what appears to be almost the impossible, instantaneous charge. How do you instantly just charge a battery? Here's what we know so far. Honestly, this is not clickbait. It is very real. Here are the details. Vanadium redox flow batteries were once considered a weird novelty that might never really work, but not anymore, that's for sure. They're being built at massive scale at a number of, in fact, many locations around the world. And quietly, the vanadium redox flow battery is actually undermining lithium ion mega batteries from companies like Tesla and CATL. And there's one very good reason for that. They are actually cheaper. And they work, well, they work just as well. Korean scientists have built what they're calling a lithium battery killer. Don't know if that's true, but that's what they're saying. It's a supercapacitor that charges in, well, seconds. But the thing is, this supercapacitor, it has some very, very unusual properties. MG, they said that their new MG4, which is a bit bigger than the old version, it's um, it's going to have the first ever mass-produced semi-solid state battery. Most of the battery is solid. Only a very small percentage of it is actually liquid. And this is meant to be a huge sales feature, right? You would think and expect that it would mean massive range for the new MG4. The world's largest battery manufacturer, CATL. They, they have a, a monopoly on the battery market. They make some incredibly good batteries, some of the best in the world. Tesla use them. Many car manufacturers use them. What this means is within the next 12 months, these batteries could be in your electric car. Wow, I really hope this media report is correct that I've just discovered in China. CATL, Cadle, the biggest battery company in the world, have kind of sneakily unveiled their 1,200 kilowatt charging sodium batteries. Um, guys, not long ago, within the last six months, I've made several videos saying that artificial intelligence predicts that sodium batteries will overtake lithium. I recently spoke at uh, the... EV Auto Show with a panel of experts and my peers in Melbourne over the weekend, and they, they disagreed with me. They said sodium is not going to really do anything. Well, actually, the facts are sodium iron is a game changer. South Korean battery manufacturer LG Energy Solution announced a landmark battery supply contract on Wednesday. Uh, sources report that the batteries might be supplied to the U.S. tech giant Tesla. If you hate Tesla, there's a lot of people now that do. You're going to hate me by the end of this video. You're going to hate Tesla even more by the end of this video because once again, they have outsmarted the industry. And once again, bizarrely, everyone has just completely ignored what they did. They've got no idea what Tesla just did, even though the facts are so obvious. They're like right in front of our face. But these new batteries, and it's very clear, Tesla signed this deal. It's open. They meant to keep it secret. They tried to, but this deal has been signed. These new batteries are the best batteries that we know of on the market. They're new. They could end up being terrible, but from what we know from the specs, the tech specs, they are the best lithium ion phosphate batteries the world has ever seen by a significant margin. So here I am thinking solid state batteries, they're not far away. They're coming soon, yeah. And many people believe that's the case. Well, this expert, uh, this scientist, he's saying no. You're wrong. Hello, my friends. Welcome to the channel. Great to have you with us. I'm Sam Evans. Yeah, you know, I, 
I'm a big fan of solid state batteries. I think it's going to bring a new element of excitement to the EV industry. When I say EV industry, we're not even going to call it the EV industry. We're just going to call it the automotive industry because all cars will be electric by 2035. But right now, at this point in time, there's anticipation. Car companies, particularly Toyota, have been hyping solid state batteries since 2014. It's 11 years. And they're saying it's here. It's, it's almost here, just over and over and over. So there's a lot of excitement around this. Really, a lot of this excitement is about the fact that we can potentially triple or even quadruple energy density. And that is very real that that can happen. Solar state batteries long heralded as the ideal energy solution for the new energy era 